Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel PG Analytics. In this video, I will talk about how to apply and use parameter actions. So in Tableau, we have variety of actions, filter action, highlight action, go to sheet, go to URL, change parameter value and change set value. So let's understand how to use change parameter value. So I will create a sheet category and let's say profit category wise profit. Now using actions parameter, we can change the value of parameter through interactions. You just click on the sheet and whatever values you click, it will pass to the parameter and that value will become the current value of your parameter. For example, I'll create one parameter, parameter, create parameter, give it a name, action parameter. I just want to load the data from category. So data type will be string list and load the data from category field. So we have three values. Three values will be loaded in parameter. Click OK. Show this parameter. So current value of parameter is furniture. Now without action parameter, if you want to change the value of parameter, you need to click on the drop down and select the value. Now, same thing we can achieve using parameter actions. So right now we are at the sheet, go to worksheet, action, add, add actions, change parameter. Now we want to change the value of parameter from source sheet, that is sheet eight. Target parameter means which parameter you want to change, which parameter you want to apply the actions. So in our scenario, it is action parameter. Now you have the source, you have the target. Now which field you want to pass from the sheet to parameter. So here we have to select the source field. I want to pass the category. So what I'm trying to do is when I click on the furniture, the current value of parameter should be furniture. If I click on office supplies, current value of parameter will be office supplies. If I click on technology, current value of the parameter will be technology. Now run action on how you want to execute. You want to click on hover or select or menu. So we'll keep it select so that action will execute when we click on the value. Clearing the sections means once you remove the actions, what you want to keep the value in parameter. You want to keep current value or set value too. You can set any values. Let's keep it okay. Now current value is technology. I will click on the furniture. See the result. The current value of parameter is now furniture. If I click on office supplies, current value of parameter is office supplies. Same thing will happen with technology. So whatever we are selecting, that will become the value of parameter. All right, that's it for this video. Thank you so much.